Hi, my name is Brad Neal, and this is something I think is pretty neat and might help you when you are developing your courses. So let me show you over here. Um, what you see on the screen is a program that's called Typora, and it is free because it is currently in beta, so Typora, there we are. The nice thing that it is, um, nice thing about it is it's a markdown editor. Okay, what's Markdown? It's more technical than what I'm going to explain because I don't understand it well enough to explain it. But what I do know is if you write stuff in Markdown language, um, it is very easy to copy and paste that Markdown stuff right into Brightspace, and then your formatting looks as you would expect. Um, sometimes when you copy and paste stuff from Word into a website or uh, what have you, some of the formatting doesn't go over well and it's kind of a, a garbled mess. Additionally, one of the nice things about Markdown is a lot of screen readers uh, work with it pretty well. So people who have visual disabilities, um, this is kind of a nice thing to do. So this is a program called Typora. Um, and how does it work, you say? Well, if you know all like the keyboard commands, you can actually just type stuff in and it will actually work for you. But if you're like me, you don't necessarily know all the keyboard commands in order to make things all nice and pretty. So what I end up doing is, let's say that normally I would want this to be, uh, this is the title of the page. Okay. If I want this to look really big, I can go up and there's this little format button that's really hard to see, but I can just go up or I can click on the uh, paragraph and I can just say, hey, I want this to be the paragraph one style. Or I can say, uh, I'm sorry, heading one style. Um, or I want it to be a something, 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 something. So it's like, this is the title of the page. In this lesson, we will learn. And then, okay, we need a formatted list. We can go and we can do our formatted list. Um, and so here's an ordered list and an unordered list. Well, an or unordered list gives us this nice little, nice little bullet. Um, here's about type aura. The fact that Brad can't type and talk simultaneously. He can't spell either. Um, and so then you have your nice little list. Now, admittedly right now, I've got this like blown up really big so that you could see it on the screen. This is what it would normally look like. It's not taking up the whole page. Um, and that's because this program has little uh, tabs next to it. So if I wanted to open up um, one of the previous files that I had already worked on, this is uh, my lesson plan for that I'm working on for week one of this semester. Um, and what I did was I copied it out of ACE and I put it into uh, this Markdown editor here. And so now stuff is in the Markdown language. So I could say, okay, I want this week one suggested thing here to be at heading one. So it looks like that. And, oh, I want this line right here. That's kind of nasty because it's actually just a bunch of dashes. You could insert uh, lines if you wanted. You could insert breaks, etc. Like here's a horizontal line. Okay, so that's like a much nicer looking line. Um, it's kind of hard to see here in the video. Anyways, we can now copy all of this information that we've got formatted and just the exact way that we want here in the Typora app in Markdown. And then if we come over to our actual ACE website, or I'm sorry, <laughs> Brightspace website, you could then go ahead and say, uh, I want to put all that information here in this description. And then if I just paste it all in and I hit update, and bang, there it all is. And there's that horizontal line. And oh, see how this was just a bunch of dashes and it looked like a bunch of dashes? Okay, see if by putting in that actual formatting there, it looks a little bit better. Um, and it's actually pretty nice and easy. And one of the nice things that's uh, good about Markdown, from my experience with it, is um, if you format your stuff properly with Markdown, what you see uh, will be what you get on pretty much all devices. Versus if you do this little dash, oops, you do that little dash trick uh, 
to make try to make a solid line. Whereas if you actually do that, the code, hey, looks exactly the way you want. So Typora, I think it's pretty cool. Um, is it more effort than just opening up Word? Absolutely. Will it give you uh, more formatting options such that your text will look exactly the way you want it to? Absolutely. Um, but I thought I'd share um, by making this video. Thank you very much. I hope it helped and uh, have a great day.